the final highest and most difficult problem of reason is how can we allow the irrational its proper scope within a general framework of rationality and benevolence. Uh, I mean, the, empirically, all cultures have worked out uh, various methods. I mean, the whole Greek uh, method of menadism and bacchic orgies and so on were all methods for getting rid of, uh, of these intolerable tensions in socially harm, harmless and even beneficent ways. The carnival, the Saturnalia, all these things are uh, are empirical devices uh, for, for doing precisely this. And I think one of our troubles is that we haven't got enough of these, Im these devices now. I mean, the Christianity became so wildly respectable that it gave up dancing, which was a grave mistake. It's very significant that the, um, this extremely, quote, spiritual sect of the Quakers quaked. I mean, here there was this violent, involuntary quaking movement of the muscles, which was a, an immense release uh, and, a, so to say, an opening up of the organism to the free flow of the life force. And this was a, an empirical invention of great value. Uh, similarly, that the sort of deliberate dancing processes of the of menadism and uh, bacchantism and the Dionysiac orgies were also methods for involving the, uh, the muscles in this general process of, of release, of getting rid of, of these pent-up uh, irrational drives in harmless ways. And it seems to me that any civilization which um, seriously takes account of, of man's nature has to invent these things. They've been invented again and again by primitive people, and even quite advanced people. And we've made the awful mistake of dropping a lot of them. I mean, the best we can do is rock and roll, which is uh, something which the uh, boys and girls have had to invent for themselves. Uh, but it, there's no sort of social or religious sanction for this, which is the gravest mistake. Whereas in the past there was. I mean, menadism was, was built into the whole social and religious pattern, and so was the, the Bacchic um, orgy system. We don't have to say that when the Quakers quaked or the Shakers shook, that this was necessarily the operation of the Holy Ghost within them. I mean, after all, the Pentecost, when people behaved in a strange way, the, the, the onlooker said, these men have drunk new wine. I mean, they did behave like drunks, uh, but they were getting rid of tensions and permitting the life force to flow through them. 